Yo guys, what is going on? My name is Mason Doherty, welcome back to my YouTubes. If you don't know who I am, I'm a husband, I'm a father, I'm a dog dad, I am a CrossFit affiliate owner, I'm a content creator, and I'm just all about those positive vibes. But if you've been here before, this is your second, third, fourth, maybe even your, this is my 14th video now, if this is your 14th time here, you definitely know that. And if this is your first time here, please make sure that you like, leave me a comment, and um, hit that little subscribe button, I'd really appreciate that. Anyway, guys, um, what I'm gonna do today is kind of put together like a, a very mini short film. Um, it's like 45 seconds. It's a bit of a, like a sports motivational sort of type of thing. I used to say something way back in the day. I didn't make this up. I actually um, first heard it referenced by uh, John Wellborn um, from, at the time it was called CrossFit Football. Uh, I don't even know what he does these days. Um, power athlete, I think it might be. I'm not even sure. But anyway, it's like a, it's like a, like a football reference and it's called, the hay is in the barn, all right? Huh? That was a bit awkward. You know what I mean? The hay is in the barn is what the, uh, the reference is. And basically that just means that all the work is done. So like I used to, I used to say this when I was prepping into competitions and I, and I would say this to other people as well. You know, you, you bust your ass, you train hard, you do all of the, you do all the right things. So come game day, you know that the work is done. All right, there's nothing more that you can do. You just gotta get out there now and just like lay it all on the line. So essentially you think the hay, the work is in the barn, it's, it's done. There's nothing more you can do, right, it's there. Now what you gotta do is just show up and do work. Anyway, I'm rambling, so let's check out that video. The hay is in the barn, which means that you've put in the hard work, you've done all that you can, You've spent the time getting in your reps. It wasn't easy, but you wouldn't want it to be either. Strength is gained through the struggle and adversity. This is why that we train and push our bodies to their absolute limits. So come game day, we know that the work has been done. We are prepared. We've put the effort in. The hay is in the barn. All that is left to do is get out there and fucking send it. <sighs> hey, I hope you, uh, hope you enjoyed that uh, little piece of uh, content that I put together. Um, maybe it got you a bit fired up, ready to get after it. Whether you, whether you play rugby, any other field sport, um, you just crossfit, you go to the gym, whatever it might be. Hopefully it was just a little something that just, <clears throat> just, just, just got you up and about. Because I know that um, I've watched that over like again and again and again and again again, all right, because I was editing this project for this particular client, but I'm just like, man, this is firing me up, and I had to really create something, um, you know, epic and just fucking sick from it. Anyway, um, I did say at the start that I was gonna let you in on a little bit of a, uh, something awful that kind of happened to me. So that very first opening shot that you saw, all right, with the, um, with the lights, well, my camera kept going round and round and round and round and round, and I landed in a tree, and it broke, and I had to get it sent away, and I don't know if I'm gonna get it back. So I've got fingers crossed that insurance might be able to help me out here. Um, right now, I'm naked, I have no drone. I've got, I've got a remote for my drone. Yeah, so. All right, so guys, I'm gonna just leave it at that, um, but you know what? Let me put that back. You know what? I keep talking about I'm all about those positive vibes and whatnot. That was literally, I'm not even kidding, shot number one that I needed for that little film that I put together. And I didn't let it get me down, all right? Because I had a job to do for a client and I wanted to bring my energy and I wanted to make them a dope fucking video. And I believe that I delivered on that. Please let me know in the comments what you think. 
My version is a little different to theirs, that they don't have the voiceover and whatnot, but it's, it's the same sort of deal. <sighs> all right, guys, that's me. I'm out. Peace. Love you all. See you next time. Mwah. Bye.